Welcome back to Ghost of a Tale. Let's waddle our way on closer to where we came from in the harbor. Can I get the handkerchief? Yes! Oh, I saw a footlocker key too. Ooh, halt! Identify yourself. Whoops. Not seen you about the keep before. <laughs> I'm a mouse. Escape from the cells. Uh... I'm Private Scow. Scow? I've just transferred here from Yuva Citadel. Yuva? My brother said Yuva. Do you know him? Wood Rengel. Yuva's a big place. Hmm. Everybody knows Wit. What squad were you with? Uh oh. The fifth! Ah, so you were down in the pit then. That explains it. Uh... Anything to report? A prisoner's escape from the jail. A mouse. I'll look out for him. Uh, he'll not slip by me, I promise you. <laughs> no, 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 come back, key. Ugh. Gotcha. So I guess, I guess the rats, like, just all over the place have their own individual footlocker key, which are all unhelpfully named exactly the same. I want to open that. Can't jump, though. Someone to talk to. Oh, 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 we're back to like the very beginning. That's the, the commander. Okay, so we made our way all the way back around. All right, in that case, this is a great opportunity to get the heck out of here and see if the blacksmith is at the usual blacksmithy place. Ah, so it looks like the blacksmith is back, and also in the same area is this whole place with the footlocker keys. It looks like the key I just got opens this one. Marked opal. So it seems like it always, like, I think the other chest as well had the opal, right? Is there anything in particular I can do with them? Oh, that's another one marked with a curious glyph. Still don't know what that means. Hmm. Anyway, let's go to the blacksmith, see if we can get our armor improved. I thought you were supposed to be by the cliff slash shore. Smithy, I have orders for you from the commander. Is that right? He said you'd know what to do with him. I'd like to tell him what to do with him. The blacksmith takes the papers, breaks the seal, and reads. Alright, so I can either work on your armor or teach you about these spider traps. Your choice. <laughs> armor first, absolutely. What can you do for my armor? Let's see. I can shave some of the parts down, rework the chest plate, make the whole thing lighter. Should let you walk more easily. Might even let you run for a bit. I'll need your armor, though, for... Let's say six hours. Okay. You fish your armor from your strangely voluminous pouch and give it to the smithy. Six hours then, and not before. Hmm. So I can try to go sleep, but I suspect I won't be able to because I just slept to get the blacksmith to actually appear because it was nighttime before. It's probably going to say you're not sleepy. Oh, never mind. We're fine. What was it, seven hours, eight hours? I don't know, can we just, like, sleep, like, 24 hours? Yeah, we can sleep 23 hours. Let's do it. How's the work on the armor? All done. The smithy gathers up the various parts of the armor from around the forge and presents them to you. 
It's not perfect, but you'll notice the difference. I could probably do more given the time. Alright, is there something else? I do want to talk to them more, but for the moment, let's put it on and see how much faster it is. And see if it looks different? Oh, it's all down here now. Oh, too close. I don't think it looks any different, but... It's... Faster? Is it faster? If it is, it's definitely not a dramatic improvement. I, I think it's faster. I thought it would maybe let me sprint. Doesn't seem like it. I guess it is faster, but it's not nearly as dramatic as I thought. A little bit of a disappointment, but I'll take anything. Okay, let's go speak with him. Yeah, what do you think of that, huh? <laughs> Join the red pie, see? What? Faced with the prospect of invasion, Roderick, the last Rat King, abandoned his crown and fled as his kingdom descended into chaos. In the king's absence, the five Rat Barons, led by Osdric, united their forces and drove back the Saltarian warships. But there was no heir to the throne, and none could be crowned king anew, for the Stone of Ascension had been lost in the shipwreck that also claimed Roderick's life. And so the barons assembled an emergency ruling council, moving quickly to restore order to the Kingdom of the Rats and the annexed lands of Meridia. Unrest was quelled with ruthless and bloody efficiency. The council's emblem, a circle surrounded by five crimson strokes, was intended to represent the five barons sitting in Congress. But in the minds of many it resembled nothing less than a bloody footprint. The age of the Red Paw had begun. So I think they're saying that just because I'm talking to them while wearing armor, perhaps? I'm not sure. Uh, so let's see if anything's changed. I haven't really spoken with them in a while. Curious about something? Why are you helping me? Give it some thought for two florins. Well, I've got 69 florins, sure. Listen. There's not a month goes by without some creature or other trying to escape. Thieves and killers all. Whether they escape or they don't, I still get paid the same, which is next to nothing. So if I can make a little money off it, why not? Oh, just in for the money. All right. Looking for some items of clothing. Okay, let's not do that for now. Need to find a few things. Anything new here? I think I already asked them for information on the checkpoint passes, and they told me where to find one, but yeah, I don't know where the other one is. Need the key to the courtyard well. Wait. I can go in the well? It's locked? The well? I see. Eight florins and I'll tell you what I can. Very well. Alright, now there's more than one copy of that key. I lost mine. Dropped it down the damned well. But the cook will have her own. Hanging up in the kitchen somewhere. Oh! Okay, I need to go back there and explore more thoroughly, because at the time I didn't have the, uh, you know, the whole costume. Okay. That's very helpful. Let's see. Uh, checkpoint passes for the Pace of Road. Two Florence. I swear I already paid for this, but I guess I'll say again. Um, they're issued at the main gate, so there's that. First, though, check the drunk's cage in the jail. The drunk's cage. What's the drunk's cage? Um, a few guards due for leave had their passes stolen. Barfin from the Night Watch is being held over it down in the jail. Wait, I... I already got their pass. That's that rat that I snuck into and they were in jail already and they were asleep. So, let's see, can they help me with 
Yet another one. Let's see. Marked out some places worth looking at. Okay, cool. Looking for roses. Nah. Pretty sure I can find them all. Help me solve a puzzle. Nope. Okay, so that's all. So what do they mark on my map exactly? A checkpoint past... Just wait. Just right over here. Right here? Oh, no. No, no, no. That must be above. I've been up here multiple times, though. I don't... I didn't think there was anything here that I haven't already gotten. Right? Yeah, this must be the place it's referring to, but... I've already been here, and there's nothing else here. Oh! <gasps> ah! Hello! Sweet! Well, while we're in the area, let's go give them to him. Am I really faster? I should maybe save first. <laughs> Look, Fatali, a mouse dressed as a guard. There's got to be a name for that. I, a traitor. Here, I have the passes we need. You do? Let's see them. Three checkpoint passes, like you said. All right. A true thief must be accomplished in a range of skills. Agility, tenacity, awareness, and the like. If you master every one of them, you can join our guild. Well, it's more of a club than a guild. How many members does your guild have? You mean including us? It doesn't matter. For now, we can teach you one skill from each discipline. So, what do you want to learn? Ooh. Okay, so yeah, they are the ones that are going to teach me skills. Okay. Um... I have no idea what these do. Let's, let's try to guess. The stack... I have no idea. The surge... Maybe sprint? Long drop, be able to fall longer, not too interested in that. Keen ears, uh, don't know. Red mist, I don't know. Strong arm. Maybe you can lift, I don't know, lift up bigger things? Is it going to give me a description for each one? Let's see. Uh, this is a good one. You see, I can show you how to stack more items in your pouch. Bottles, sticks, and the like. Ooh. That'd be pretty helpful. But not, not amazing, though. Let's look at each one. The Surge. I'll show you how to move quickly, to more quickly recover your stamina when you're exhausted. Okay, that would be absolutely amazing. That is almost certainly what I'm going to go with. Because I run out of stamina all the time. The Long Drop. Pretty sure I know what that is. Recover quickly from hard landing after a high fall. Nope. Keen Ears. A way to sense when an enemy is nearby. Hmm. Nah. Wait, what did I just do? Oh, I think they're just going on with a larger description. Um, glowing aura, something like that. Wait, did I just accidentally get it or something? I think I'm going to reload. There we go. Yeah, I accidentally said, yes, teach me it. So, the red mist. A true thief has a talent for seeing what items are ripe for the taking. It's like they just leap out at you. Hmm. Okay, so it just highlights things you can take. Strong arm. 
Uh, it's all about technique. Bottle sticks, whatever. You can do a lot more damage if you throw them just so. Hmm. So perhaps that would allow me to throw a bottle at a guard that had, like, a helmet on and knock him out or something. I don't really care about that, though. I, I mean, I have a guard's uniform. I don't really need to knock him out anymore. I guess there's, like, spiders, but... Eh, I'm definitely going stamina. All right. The surge. Teach me how. Oops, I accidentally skipped that. Uh, I guess we're done. Um, what else do we need? At the top of the watchtower, there's a rat. A real horrible scrunt. You mean Silas, the signal guard? Yeah, that scrunt. We need a spyglass. Oh. Well, I've already got it. Why? To scout ahead. Watch the roads for patrols. Okay. You don't sound convinced. He isn't your friend, Mouse. But we are. He's just a rat. A real scrunt, that one. But he's helping me, isn't he? Come on, he's using you. Why should I believe you? You trust a rat over us? Look in his footlocker, then see if you still think him a friend. Hmm, I need a key for that, don't I? I wonder if the key's on him. Could I just steal it? I never even thought about that. Anyway, well, here's the spy glass you wanted. Good. That didn't take too long. I perhaps I'm getting better at this. No, I'm saying it didn't take too long to get the spy glass. It was easy. What? <laughs> too long is considered by many, including his peers and his own self, to be the greatest thief alive. Oh, I think we've already read this. Tale of his Darien Guile or near legendary. Yep, yep, yep. I think so. Or maybe we read part of that. I'm not sure. Oh, you mean Too Long the Thief. Oh, he's more than just a thief. He's the greatest thief alive. Must be quite the mouse. Too Long's our hero. We'd give anything to meet him. Anything. All right, so what skill can we show you? What would be the next most useful thing? Stacking multiple things. I'm thinking stacking multiple things or perhaps showing things you can pick up. Hmm. Let's show things I can pick up. Like I told you, truth you vested out for seeing that items are right for the taking. Mm -hmm. Show me how. It's not something we can show you, it's... Uh, you really need to see it for yourself. Dad called it a psycho-spiritual manifestation of greed. <laughs> I call it the Red Mist. Can really leave you feeling drained, though, so beware. Concentrate to detect items around you. Right button to use the skill. We've hidden something here in the cell. See if you can find it. So it looks like it even shows like NPCs, just maybe anything you can interact with. Yeah, it takes a takes two bars of stamina. Okay, cool. What do we need now? Three sackcloth hoods. <laughs> I already got them. For us to wear as disguises. Once we're on the road to Pesa, we can hide ourselves among the other travelers. You're small. You could still pass for a pup. If it were dark. Here, got him. Is that so? Not bad, I'll stash them away. See, Gusto. And you said he was useless. Wow, so I've had like a lot of this... These skills backed up. That <laughs> should have been doing a long time ago. Should have focused on the uh, passes earlier. Let's get on with it. Alright. So, what do you want to learn? What would be the next best thing? I think probably the stack. Stacking more items. So I don't run out of like candles and sticks and stuff. 
This is a good one. You see, I can show you how to stack more items in your pouch. Mm -hmm. Teach me that. The mouse shows you how to stack items more efficiently in your pouch. Alright then, that's it. So what's next? At midnight of the tenth day, on a moonless night, at Pyram's Landing, we'll be met by our contact. Big Jaff, Yaff, the smuggler. He'll be waiting in his skiff, just offshore. We'll need a thief's whistle to call to them. I see. We headed to Jars on the way in here. Tossed it in the Sunder Crab's pen down in the harbor. Oh! Well, I've already been to the pen. I didn't find it, though. Right under the guards' noses. See if you can find it. Okay, cool. Okay, so now we have this vision. That highlights stuff. Such as this! I always thought this looked like sort of like a weird secret passage here. I guess it is. Is there more than one? Um. Well, I mean, this one I can't interact with. I'm using the sense. This is the only one that's appearing. Oh, hello. Huh. Which way are they supposed to be, though? I don't actually know. Not that there's that many combinations. I mean, it wouldn't be that hard just to... Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> cool. I didn't take much trial and error. Ah. Okay, that's a nice little shortcut, because I'm probably going to need to see them pretty frequently. Nice. Gets me around the guard really easily. So yeah, I wonder how many items I can hold now. I'm guessing 10, because before it was 5. I should probably save too. So we should have increased stamina, or at least increased stamina regen. Let's see. I don't know if it's using it slower. But definitely comes back much faster. Nice. Okay, um, what should I do now? Let me look through my quests and pick something. So I just paid pretty much like half of my money or maybe a little bit more to the uh, blacksmith to have them tell me where to find all the pieces for all the costumes. I figured, you know, my money is just burning a hole in my pocket. I don't use it for much. So pretty much everything's marked on my map now. It looks like there's actually, I think the remaining two pieces of, it looks like the Oh, I was going to say the thief costume. I guess that's the ranger costume. That are in the courtyard, and the other pieces of the other armor things are in other places. So let's see if we can find them. Oh, and I finally figured out what that, like, white square thing next to it meant. I thought it was kind of, like, pointing to that or something, but it means it's, like, above you or below you, or if it's not there and it's just white, like this one that's right in front of me, then that means it's on your level. Don't know why that took me so long to get. This is kind of obvious. Ah. It's in here. Gallery chest key. Where might that be? It's not on you. Oh. Wait, I think it might be on you. How do I get that from you? Oh, no, I did not mean to do that. Uh, forgive me, sir. Farewell. Haha, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Ranger's hood. Yeah, the boots will be the final piece. That should allow me to be amongst the guards and move very fast, I think. Even faster than this quote-unquote improved armor. So, next piece is up and this direction. I think I've been over here already, and I think I've gone up, but I didn't see it. Yeah, I got up this way. Pushed this pin out, walked here, jumped over here. So it's on this level. 
Hmm. Grill doesn't look well secured. Oh, I can throw a thing at that and let it down. Dang it. Oh, okay, it worked. Cool. Ranger's boots. I've got the full set of Ranger stuff. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, Escape Beetle. Hey there. Just one more. All right, let's take a look. Uh, so let's just look at what it does to my stats. Better stamina recovery. Uh, I don't know what the yellow means for the sprint speed. What does that mean? Oh. Oh, is the sprint speed what... No, wait, what? Is that what's been added by the uh, the skill that I got? Th did that increase my sprint speed? It might have. Maybe that's what the yellow means. Yeah, so this armor gives you a bit better resistance to weapons and fire, but... I mean, I, it's not like I'm getting hit with weapons or fire all the time. It's so rare. So the most important thing is definitely stuff like sprint speed and stamina recovery. Auditive discretion, visual visual discretion, so a little bit more stealthy. Dead ringer for a ranger. <laughs> I look so cool. Oh my god, those costumes. You know, seriously, developers, you want to make like DLC for this game that I'll buy? Just make more costumes. Just make more costumes. They're adorable. Look at a fluffy little tum tum. Just showing. Okay, yeah, so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what the yellow means because of the skill. So we should be able to sprint faster and have better stamina recovery. Nice. And I think we can go by guards, and I don't think they'll care. Right? Hmm. Maybe they do care, but like a lot less. What is that? Oh, 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 that's like, <laughs> they'll call out and say like, who are you? What business have you here? Hmm. I'm supposed to be standoffish to them, right? Like we have an uneasy truce. My own business, rat. All right, all right, I was only asking. All right, move on. Hmm. So now that one... Oh, okay, there's like a little bit of a cooldown. Hmm. So it looks like they pretty much see you as fast as if you were, you know, just not wearing anything, just wearing your minstrel outfit. Seems like they see you exactly as fast, except instead of attacking you, they just yell at you. Get out of here, or you'll be spending the night in jail. Okay, and I guess they remember if they've seen you recently, and they're like, okay, you're being weird. So, it's basically just a better minstrel outfit, right? Because, I mean, it strictly speaking, it's simply better than a minstrel outfit. It gives me better stats, and a better result from being seen, but definitely not something that allows me to blend in. Still, though, super useful. <laughs> I love how that looks. Okay. What shall I do now? Hmm. I think what I'll do now is end this episode here. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. Probably go down to the harbor and see if I can find the thief's whistle. <laughs> 